Thank you for your hard work for Jeb. Thank you for what you're going to do, which is to vote for him on Saturday here in the great state of South Carolina. The presidency is often defined by the unexpected. There's going to be crises, and it's important to have a president who can handle them with calm resolve. When Americans woke up on September the 11th, we did not know that the world would forever change that day. I was sitting in a classroom in Florida, listening to a child read. My chief of staff, South Carolina graduate Andy Card, whispered in my ear, a second plane has hit the second tower, America is under attack. My first reaction is, that's hot. We're going to deal with these people. My second reaction when I was staring at this young child is that my job became crystal clear, and that is to protect her, her community, and her country.
These are great readers. Yes, they are. Very impressive. Thank you also very much for showing me your reading skills. I bet they practice too, don't you? Oh, yes. That's a requirement. Homework. Reading homework. Reading more than they watch TV? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You try to do that? Read more than you watch TV? Mm. Oh, that's great. Very good. Very important to practice. Thanks for having me. Thank you. Very impressive. Read this book. Because of those closure readers, place them under your chairs. And thank you so much. Thank you, Preston. You can step out the door with you, please.